not terribly impressed with that particular passion play. Yeah. They've done OK in the opening ten minutes, but here it is now. Crew wide with the great web. They'd love to go to the left-hand side. And they do with Hall. He gets away from Makinson. Ball inside to Maguire. Try to the lead Rhinos. Quick shoulder attack down the left-hand side. Here's Pulatua. So important for St Helens that this fellow fires. He's missed the last five. He's only played in nine. They do miss oh, him when he's not there. Tackle. A great offload as well. Here's Pulatua once more. And yeah, I agree with you. I think he's potentially more important than James Roby. But so often he fractures the defensive line on which the back then Roby then goes on to attack. Runs to Shenton. And uh, Maguire gobbles him up. Now, did Shenton lose that? Certainly bobbled. Touch judge said it's okay. That's a great kick. It'll bounce awkward. It has bounced awkwardly and it's picked up. And is it a try? It is for yes. Lomax, I think. It is. The referee won't refer that one upstairs. Ooh, that was a big hit. Tony Pulatua, legs pumping. There he is, Louis McCarthy scars broke off the bench and uh, really lined Danny Maguire up there. But this is working. Sometimes hard to describe Eddie from up here with the impact that's, uh, that's occurring on the field down below us. There was a reserve game on before here. You stand down by the sideline, you can hear the bodies clatter into each other. Super League is another level. These fellas are putting their bodies through the mill tonight to entertain us. Absolutely they are. Here's Roby, he's broken the defence, he's got Lomax with him, he finds Lomax. Lomax on to Wellens, brilliant try. I thought that, uh, that uh, Callum Watkins is it. That was almost a professional foul by uh, Tommy Makinson. Yep. Here's Clarkson, thunderous challenge by Roby low down and Flanagan. Burrow, Maguire, Sinfield attacking the line, Sinfield, what a run, what a pass, what a try, Brett Delaney. So we'll have to hire the big, we'll be disappointed with that. Bailey takes it forward to the 40 metre mark. No, not the best player the ball. that St Helens were offside at that play of the ball, they have to wait until the referee gives them the signal. You can hear it in the background, he's pulling them back, look, then he'll say move and go. There we go, they can move forward now. Well, this is where the point, and he's having a big game as well, Kyle Lulawai. I think a little bit more running from Dominic Half from Rob Burrow, that's what's needed. Good ball from Webb to Jamie Jones Buchanan! Great try from Jamie Jones Buchanan, that is his first try of two. Oops. So that was play on, hence the reason why St. Helens have this possession. Ten minutes of the second half gone, Saints 40 metres away, Clough trying to go inside Burrow. Clattered to the ground, though, by Daryl Griffith. Here's Josh Perry again, finds Johnny Lomax, wide they go to Wellens, further wide to Shenton. Shenton taking them on, great ball! Oh, what a try! Has Makinson got this down? And Sinfield got him head on. Here's Flanagan again, gets the ball to Wheeler. 18-16, 57 minutes gone, 23 remaining, the match to be won in the next 23 minutes. Don't go anywhere on Super League Monday because this game is far from over. They've got no fullback. Brent Webb has been involved in the tackle, maybe the chip over the top. Oh, what a ball from Lomax, what a run from Soliola, what a try from Saints. Second try for Johnny Lomax. He's taking a few steps forward, quite happy to just feed the forwards. And LaFranchi takes it on. That's the third tackle, and uh, St. Helens now 11 metres away from the Leeds line with Perry. And here is Lomax. He finds Ohio. Ohio tried to throw the dummy. Ablett wouldn't be fooled. Webb came in and completed the tackle. There's Wellens. Here is Mark Flanagan. Now then, what can St. Helens produce here? Can they... Pierce, this leads defence, they can, with Wilkin! Of course, and guided around the field by James Roby. Here's Wilkin again. They get him down. I'd be looking for a one-pointer, just to please me. Well, Lomax is back and deep, and they go back to him. He goes for the one, Johnny Lomax, and that'll win it for the Saints.